Hey, frugal mamas. So this is the video that I was supposed to upload, and it has been a crazy week. Um, you know, I am a teacher, and I am trying to get through uh, our textbook and get some review done at the same time. Um, I teach bell to bell. I mean, the, it's always like this in the spring, and we take our state test next week. So... This week has been crazy, and I had, you know, lots of plans to do things, and no, it wasn't going to happen. <laughs> I'm getting to work at 7.30 and um, getting home exhausted. Thank God for the meatless meal menu. But, you know, I, I was looking at the comments for this particular video. Oh, by the way, that's the palette that, uh, we're, that I'm giving away. And I'm giving away the mermaid brushes. Yes. And there's way more than that. That's just some of them. It, it was a huge pack. So I'm going to give those away because I love them. And they're on my Amazon cart. And my husband said, well, don't mail them to the house. You know, <laughs> you're supposed to be frugal. Wait till you announce the winner, get the address, and then mail it to them. You know, you purchase it from Amazon and ship it to them. Like, duh, that's genius. Why didn't I think of that? <laughs> anyway, um, so I, I'm i going to try to answer some of the questions. Okay, so here's how I'm going to do it. I'm just going to tell you what I'm doing. I am laying down a light color. Now, I put a primer on my face. And it's not necessary, it's not really a primer, but it has a consistency of a primer. And so I'm using it as a primer. And it's the uh, Avon Solutions Banishing Cream. It's for skin discoloration. And I love it. And I even put it on my eyes and it sticks. Okay. Because some of you see my videos that I make right after work and my makeup is still on. So like, um, you know, um, you know, like Bob Ross, you're going to have to put down the base color. And so I choose a light color and then I just go from there. Now I choose to color the whole lid. It just works for me. And I have seen some makeup, uh, you know, artists that don't do it that way, but I'm not a makeup artist. <laughs> This is just me doing the best I can. Um, so I decided to go with purple and green. I was wearing kind of a purplish green top. And so I just went with it. And I had seen on Pinterest some eye looks. And this had been done. The the green color at the corner of the eyes. You know, the inside of the eye near the tear duct. As you see what I'm doing. So I'm not doing anything fancy. I'm not doing a cut crease. Uh, now, what, what they mean by cut crease is you see where my eye um, makes a crease, okay? My eyelid, when I open my eyes, there's a natural crease. Well, some girls are actually only, they're taking concealer and covering your whole eyelid. Not up to your brow, but up to the crease. And then they're applying makeup and it just gives it a nice finish, I don't have time for that. You know, when I play with my makeup, I would, but I'm not really playing with my makeup. So I, um, I'm just, you know, laying down color and, and kind of going at, you know, doing the best I can. Now I'm going to lay down some color right at the uh, lash line and a little at, you see at the, at the corners near my crease. Now, th what I'm going to do next covers so many multitudes of sin. So when it looks lopsided to me, I will blend, 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 blend. I That was one of my biggest mistakes when I first started playing with makeup about a year and a half ago was I wasn't blending correctly or enough. You've got to be patient. And I was also using horrible lighting. So when I would go outside and get into the car and look at the car mirror, I looked hideous. I mean, and I mean that. I mean, like, I, I, I just didn't understand was what happened. <laughs> and 
I highly recommend you invest in some good lighting. Get a nice makeup mirror. Uh, sit in front of the window. Uh, you know, do what you got to do to to get an accurate look at your color. Um, and and that and then the blending. That blending goes a long long way. Just now, don't brush it off. I actually take the the tip of the brush and I jab it gently. So basically as if I was pressing it in. Now I'm using right, just what you just saw, ColourPop setting spray. I used to wear e.l.f. and I loved e.l.f. but I got this on sale so that's what I'm using. Setting spray is not a gimmick and I used to think this is just a necessary products, you know, that these cosmetic companies are trying to get you to buy. I, if you need to go super frugal, I highly recommend e.l.f. Uh, that ColourPop setting spray, I got two bottles for 10 bucks on Woot. Woot.com, W-O-O-T.com. Um, it is not a gimmick. It's not a joke. Uh, it will keep your makeup in place. And I put setting spray on my brush when I'm going to use glitter, like I just did. I got into the the green glitter and just put a little, just a hint so that you know it's there. And then at the end of the day, it'll fall into your cheeks. <laughs> it will. I mean, you know, um, I do spray after I'm done. Okay. Now there I got a cotton swab, one of those square cotton patches and I got some liquid, um, makeup remover. Um, it's not the micellar water. I, I don't know what it's called. I'll, I'll have to go and look. In fact, I'll look right now. But keep that on hand. You can even use wipes so that any fallout, any eyeshadow that falls into your face, you can just wipe it out. Okay, here it is. This is micellar water. Yeah, from Tarte. And this actually, I want. I think my sister-in-law gave this to me. I don't know where I got this from. My daughters gave it to me. Um, yeah, Tarte Micellar Magic Makeup Remover and Cleanser. So I keep this uh, at my makeup table, and I got the little cotton swabs, and then it's a really neat pump top, and uh, I clean around my eye. But, you know, you can use the 99-cent makeup uh, remover wipes that you get at the grocery store because you're not really using it to cleanse your face. You're just using it to wipe off the, the, the fallout. And I'm using the, uh, you know, the Maybelline um, Sky High. I love it. Um, even with my wonky left eyelashes, which are, I don't know why, but they decided they just do not want to curl anymore. And I know people tell me you got to start curling your eyelashes with the curling, you know, with the eyelash curler. It doesn't work. I mean, I've tried. So... I don't know what to do, but this, this mascara hasn't disappointed me. I like it, but here's the deal. I think I like the other uh, mascara that I was using. Um, let me get it. Let me see what I have. Um, where is it? Yeah, I don't know. I use Essence Lash Princess, and I like the Essence Lash Princess because it's thicker. And I like the Sky High because it just makes your lashes, you know, pop. It really does. So maybe I'm going to use both of them together. I mean, you make up the rules as you go. You don't have to follow any. I might actually do both of them. Like use the Sky High to get the length and then to thicken them up with the uh, Lash Princess. You know what? That's what I'm going to do next time. Uh, someone was asking me what my skincare uh, routine is, and it's pretty simple. First of all, um, I'm I'm gonna be a little shameless right now because it's my you know my YouTube, but I'm all about Avon. I really am, and I'm not a ashamed to say it. I sell it and I wear it. When it comes to makeup, I'll wear anything. It, I'm I'm you know everything's fair game. But when it comes to skincare, I am in love with South Korean skincare products. And right now, the, the, the company that has um, the best prices and, you know, the most affordable 
South Korean skincare is Avon. And so, um, I'm in love. Okay, so in the morning, I will prime my face with the Avon and New Vitamin C. It's a brightening serum. On top of that, I will put my banishing cream, which is a skin discoloration improver. Those are the only two products I'll wear in the morning, okay? Oh, okay, wait a minute. I will use the vitamin C antioxidant lip moisturizer because I wake up with really dry cracked lips. Now at night, uh, like right now, because it's in the evening, I will, I have two, I have three products, okay? I use the therapy. Um, let me see. What is it called? I have it here. Anti-aging formula. It's from Avon. It's when Avon and the face shop, you know, got together and they're, and so now we're selling the therapy. And what else? Where is my night cream? I use a, um, hyaluronic acid gel. I do that to I do that once or twice a week. Lately I've only been doing it once a week. I use the therapy moisturizer every single night and I use the a new clinical eye lift on Sundays when I do my, you know, DIY spa day. I also will use the a new power serum uh, under my mask. That's on Sundays. So on Sundays I have like lots of skincare that I do and then the rest of the week I mean, sometimes I just, you know, wash my face and put on the therapy. Um, and I also have these rice water wipes. Now, there's a lot of people, especially on TikTok, the TikTok dermatologists, you know, they're all, don't use wipes. They're disgusting. They're horrible. Not these. These are South Korean rice water wipes. They're a little pricey. You're going to get 50 wipes for $11, but I cannot express to you how amazing they feel. So, okay, so this is my makeup look, and I don't even have a full face of makeup. It looks like I do, but I don't. It's just my eye makeup and my lipstick. You guys have a great evening. I'll talk to y'all later.